Yo, what is up squad? It's your boy Pino E here. Happy Wednesday. Let's get right into this video, but don't forget to hit that thumbs up. If you're new around here, smash that like button and let's go. Let's kick today off with Converse. And for the Converse fans watching this, we got to look at the upcoming Chuck Taylor Summer Pack, comprised of five colorways, all done up in a muted hue to give the impression of a washed look. Completing each shoe in the pack is an off-white midsole with black piping, white laces, and silver eyelets. If you like these, then heads up, they're available now at select retailers for $70 each. We're going to make a quick stop at Puma, and in my opinion, they have one of the best dad shoes out right now, the Puma Thunder Spectra. Sometime in August, you could expect the silhouette to release in a tonal gray upper with shades of orange and blue, used as accenting colors, and of course, the construction will be a mix of mesh, suede, and leather. Sometime in August is the date, and retail will come in at $120. Over to Adidas, and we've talked about the Adidas Continental 80 a bunch, so I'm not going to get into the details, but for any of you who've been waiting for the silhouette to drop, we have a date for three colorways. Coming in cloud white, running white, or core black, all three pairs will drop on June 21st on adidas.com and at select retailers for $80 a piece. Let's talk about some fuckery here, and next up we got the Adidas Young One, and I've talked shit about this silhouette, but they actually look not so bad in this muted white cream and gray colorway. I would have even said they could be a possible cop, but there's a retailer, and I'm not going to name them because of the fuckery, but there's a retailer out in New York who's getting this pair as an exclusive colorway, and they decided if you want them, you're going to have to buy a 10-piece collection. Not a t-shirt and a pair of shorts, but 10 fucking pieces. T-shirts, track tops, shorts, and some other bullshit to get the shoes. So if you want this colorway, your minimum cost is $1,500. Fuckery, this is just pure fuckery. Let's move on. Next up, we got the Adidas I5923 coming dressed in a white, navy, and gum colorway. And if you want these, you need to buy a house, and then you could own these shoes. The house will cost you $675,000, and it's in Detroit. Okay, I'm still tripping off that stupid-ass fuckboy $1,500 pack, so ignore me. But anyway, if you want this pair up on screen, they're available now for $130. And last up for Adidas, we got a first look at John Wall's next shoe, but let me clarify that. What you're looking at are the Adidas Marquee Boost, but the pairs up on screen are John Wall PEs, which are not expected to drop. The model is, however, and you can expect the Marquee Boost in a mid to release this December for $150 and in a low for $140 next January. What I like about myself is that I'm an equal opportunity hater. So if I see trash, I don't care who puts it out. I'm going to call it like I see it. And these two pairs of the Air Max 90 coming in black or orange with all over Air Max print and embossed branding are straight doo-doo. I like the Air Max 90, so it takes a lot for me to say that. But it is what it is, and these things drop September 6th. And last up for Nike, we are one day away from the release of the off-white Nike Zoomfly Mercurial Flyknit with both pairs, one in black and the other in orange, ready to drop tomorrow. If you're in the US, then they will drop at 10 a.m. Pacific or 1 p.m. Eastern as a draw on the sneakers app. And you already know how I feel about that broken down, bitch-ass, bot-infested fuck-up that Nike calls a draw. If you're in Canada, pairs drop tonight at midnight Pacific or 3 a.m. Eastern on Nike.ca with the pairs running for $200 a piece Europe I'm sorry I don't know your details but check your sneakers app yo wish me luck I need one of these two both if I'm lucky but fuck the draw regarding the clothing I'm going for a hoodie and the track pants and they are expected to release at the same time as the shoes so to all of the squad good luck I hope you eat some of you will but once again in case you missed it fuck the draw we really don't got much in the way of Jordan brand, but we do have the Jordan why not 0.1 fashion king can we just stop right there for a second fashion king this guy is really calling himself a fucking fashion king this guy who makes kanye's homeless clothes look like high fashion or this guy wearing some kind of big city ninja outfit probably hiding his ninja stars in his back pocket or how about this guy i guarantee if you look at old pictures of your mom she had these same pants how about here where he looks like he's a kid living back in 1872 maybe 14 years old who knows getting sent up a chimney to do some cleaning anyway whatever the fashion kings are they're like an ugly girl in the club you see how good these look with the 3m right but once you turn the lights on you want to get these shits off your feet anyway june 16th is the date and 125 is the price and that does it for today's video everyone if you enjoyed it and i hope you did hit that like button if you're new around here subscribe join the squad if you've got something to say leave it in the comments below and i'm out